author of the polyptic is Defendante Ferrari, a painter from Chivasso, whose activity is known between 1497 and 1531. He painted it on commission of the inhabitants of Moncalieri, who offered it to the preceptory in 1531 as thanks since they had been freed from the pestilence. In the architectonic golden wooden frame there are the nativity in the central compartment, St. Anthony Abbot on the left, St. Rocco on the right, St. Sebastian at the top left and St. Bernardino from Siena at the top right. Some scenes from the life on the Virgin are represented on the outside of the lateral shutters which can be used to shut the polyptic and there are illustrations of scents on the inside. It's worth watching St. Anthony Habbard visiting St. Paul the Hermit in the right upper square. Seven episodes of St. Anthony's life are represented on the altar steps from his conversion to the temptation and eventually the meeting with St. Paul the Hermit, who is later laid to rest by St. Anthony. These episodes are similar to the Jacquerius frescoes on the right wall of the presbytery. This painting represents the overcoming of the Gothic style. We can note Renaissance elements such as the volumetry of the figures and the use of perspective. The wooden statue of St. Anthony. The St. holds in his right hand a stick with the letter Tau symbol of the Antonian order and the book of the gospel in his left hand. At the feet of the saint a small pig is represented. The statue dates back to the end of the 14th century and was probably made in France.